The following is a segment from the iPhone 4 video product guide produced by showyouhow.com. This segment will show you how to set up and use email with the iPhone 4. iPhone works with MobileMe, Microsoft Exchange, and many of the most popular internet-based email, contacts, and calendar service providers. To use MobileMe on iPhone, you'll need to set up a MobileMe free account or a MobileMe paid subscription. Start by going to Settings and then tap Mail Contacts Calendars. Tap Add Account and then tap Mobile Me. Enter your Apple ID and password or tap Create Free Apple ID and follow the on-screen instructions. Verify your email address if required. Then make sure Find My iPhone is turned on. To use Microsoft Exchange on iPhone, you'll need to add an account with your Microsoft Exchange account settings. See your service provider or system administrator for those settings. In Settings, tap Mail Contacts Calendars. Then tap Add Account, and then Microsoft Exchange. Enter your complete email address, domain, which is optional, username, password, and a description. The description can be whatever you'd like. Setting up a Google, Yahoo, or AOL account is very similar. In Settings, tap Mail Contacts Calendars. Tap Add Account, and then Google, Yahoo, or AOL. Enter your name, complete email address, password, and a description. Again, the description can be whatever you'd like. Tap the items you want to use on iPhone. Available items depend on the service provider. Now that you have an account set up, here's how to check your email. The mail icon on the home screen will show you the number of unread messages that you have in your inbox. Please note, you can have more than one mailbox. Tap the mail icon, then tap the inbox you want. A list of emails will then appear. To access an email, tap it, and it will open. The open email text may appear small to you. You may enlarge it by spreading it with your fingers. To scroll about the screen, slide your finger in the direction you want to go. To resize a column of text to fit the screen, double tap the text. You can view the next or previous message by tapping the up or down arrows within a message. To go back to your inbox, tap the inbox arrow at the top of the screen. Adding an email recipient to your contact list is easy. First, tap the message, and if necessary, tap Details to see the recipients. Then tap a name or email address and tap Create New Contact or Add to Existing Contact. Another great feature of iPhone 4 is the ability to view email attachments, including JPEG. GIF, and TIFF inline images. You can listen to MP3, AAC, WAV, and AIFF audio files, and download and view PDF, web page, text, pages, keynote, numbers, and Microsoft Word, Excel, and PowerPoint documents. To view an attached file, tap the attachment to open it in Quick Look. You may need to download the attachment first. To view the complete iPhone 4 video product guide, as well as our other video product guides, please visit showyouhow.com.